all right guys and girls we're back just to show you the demonstration of the um, amplifier section that I talked about what happens here is that I just use the same value of resistors here so in my implementation over there I use 5k1 for both resistors so these values are the same uh, green brown and red for both of them uh, the color codes so if you know your color codes you understand this um, if you don't know your color codes, you can just check online or just use your digital meter to read the resistors. But I use 5K1 for, for each of them. And um, yeah, that's pretty much it. The infrared here, I use the longer pin to ground. Uh, you need to bias it in that configuration. If you reverse it, you you still pick up the signal, but it will be very weak. So I'm going to show you what, what happens here. So remember the first video I have to be very close this way to, to get the signal but now I can pretty much go far away and I pick the signal so depending on how good your amplification is you could actually uh, get it from 5 or, or 10 feet away anyway so that's pretty much it and then I have the this connection here between the resistor and uh, this is the collector of this transistor so this guy goes to the voltage control of my 555 timer so it goes to this point and remember I didn't use this capacitor in this configuration that is it pretty much so play around with this and um, make make some your, your own circuits and post some questions and we'll be able to uh, to get back to you as soon as possible um, if you have questions just like some of you have been doing um, write, write us an email uh, post question on our on our video and um, we'll be able to get back to you and just be a little patient with us we've been busy doing other things as you can see here these are not for for YouTube but um, we've been busy doing other things we're just taking a little break to to get to do this for you um, I promised in my other video that I was gonna do this but we got into doing other things that I know really for for YouTube just for other projects that we're working on but yeah that's it pretty pretty much if you have any questions um post it someone might have a question um what does why does one need this kind of a stable multivibrator and i'm going to answer it even before you ask me one thing i noticed is that this you can play around with the frequency this formula to get any frequency that you want and uh, one thing i heard is that uh female mos mosquitoes are the ones that carry um, malaria parasites the anopheles mosquitoes carry malaria parasites and the male mosquitoes make noise make sound in the order of 22 kilohertz so if you design this it'll make your frequency 22 kilohertz and you design this circuit you'll be able to scare away the the, the male mosquitoes because this your circuit will be making sound equivalent to a male mosquito and female mosquitoes don't like mating so they, they tend to stay away from the male mosquitoes so when you make this circuit you're able to to scare away the the anophilus mosquitoes and you're able to save yourself from some malaria parasites um shout out to my friends in africa and the other parts of the world in india and everywhere where you still have mosquitoes i don't know everywhere they have mosquitoes and, and malaria we still have mosquitoes everywhere or the places I've been to but um, it's not as prevalent as other places so if you are in danger of malaria or mosquito attacks then you you might need to just um, get 155 timer and a few more components so here if, if you look around here you see there's 155 timer one capa two capacitors and one resistor that is all you need 155 timer two capacitors two capacitors one resistor and a speaker sizable speaker a lot of you can get this from any maybe small radios or um i got this from from um pc i think the pc speaker so you can get one from your your pc speaker and uh, just go to an old pc and pick take the speaker from inside or you can buy one from any shop and that that is it pretty much ignore the other parts of this but they use for other things so this guy is watching it just a few components and you're 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 good to go uh your voltage control don't leave this pin floating if you are not interested in the infrared section just put a capacitor about 0 0.1 microfarad to ground and you'll be good 
all right make your videos post your questions and um yeah see you again soon bye bye Alright, bye Hacker fans.